Hey guys, this is Scott Leroy, Scott Leroy Marketing, coming in for another weekly tip. And today's tip is about the IDX sites and how you can actually find some new designs that you can utilize on the IDX sites on their own. All right, so in this case, you can actually start to really market the IDX sites even further. All right, if you want to send it out on social media, if you want to send it out via email, all right, or if you want to update some of the hero images as well on the IDX page, I mean, I'm sorry, site homepage. All right, so in order to access this, we'll want to go to Designs over here. So we can click on the little Designs logo on the left-hand side once we're inside Command. All right, once we click on Designs on here, this is going to show all of our previous designs that we've taken a look at, anything we may have updated. All right, but let's go and click that blue plus sign at the bottom right down here. All right, technically it's a white plus sign with a blue circle, but let's go and click on the plus sign at the bottom right down here. All right, and now we're going to click on the Social option. All right, so we're going to click on social, that middle button on here, and then we're just going to click on create design. We don't have to worry about importing photos and text from a listing. Once we click on create design on here, all right, now it's going to show all the different templates we can actually utilize for social media through WeBrands. Now, if you notice, they're all alphabetized on here, and the first one that comes up is the agent site. All right, so now you can actually see here are six different options that we can actually add inside on LinkedIn, on Instagram stories, over on Twitter. And then there's even new site hero images that you can go through and update as well if you want to add inside your own information. All right, so all you'd have to do if you want to update any of these, like say if I want to use Facebook, I can click on this for instance and select use. And then much like I'm editing any of the other items inside our design section or inside Sketchhouse, however you want to consider it, all right, it's going to give us the same editor in the back end on here. So now we can start to move certain items around. All right, we can click on this if we want to update this with our information instead. All right, you can add inside your DBA logo. All right, you can go through here and update all this information. And then once you have it completed, just click the download button at the top right. All right, and then you can download a JPEG, a PNG, or a PDF. All right, or of course, you can even save this on here too. So I can click the save option. I can click done once I'm completed. And you can go through and update any of this information on here. All right, so this is a great way to really get your new IDX site pushed out to everyone, whether it's on social media, via email, however it might be. All right, and then once again, you can access all those new hero images too through the design section. So there you go. So that is your K to command tip for the day.